That's right, Graham. If you've ever wondered how a reality TV show can transform a complete house makeover in just seven days, well, this morning we did it in things in seven days. We did it in two hours in our Expresso Live Bedroom Design Challenge, where we put two design teams head to head in the ultimate bedroom makeover. Now, how the winner will be determined, that is completely up to you, our Feel Good Breakfast Show viewer. What you had to do was head on over to Facebook, to our Facebook page, and go and t vote. T cast your vote for who you thought is the winning team and that is going to determine who wins at the end of the show. So it's time for us to meet the team. So team one next to me we have Morsa and Sabir and the two of you designed this beautiful side of the bedroom. I have to ask you what international trends or what trends and decor themes did you incorporate in your look? Um, it's definitely uh, contemporary with the uh, influence of uh, wall silhouettes and uh, this, this silhouette that we created right here is uh, we actually used masking tape for it and um, it's um, a great a great a great uh, feature at that we thought about that as nice graphics and uh, we about to when we used uh, it creates more emphasis on the space okay yeah when we space it up and divide it into different sections and it's definitely contemporary and with the uh, influence of uh, wall silhouettes. I have to say, I really like the masking tape mm -hmm. idea because I know a lot of people still rent. You can't really, tape, yes, you can't really paint the space, but yeah. using the tape really creates something yeah, yeah, different. Yeah. Well, time for us to meet Team Two, and over here we have Talia and Kyle. The two of you designed that side of the bedroom, or we're we calling this the bedroom. I need to ask you: Did you have a particular theme in mind, and how did you incorporate that into your look? Okay, well. First of all, we basically had a theme of travel and we used Woodstock as an inspiration, as a form of vintage and with a subtle hint of a time. And that was 1920 basically and up, having a big clock and briefcases in front to show travel with um, a phone to emphasize on the old methods that we took into consideration. And yeah. Okay, so you really pulled your theme through. I, need, I know you guys didn't have a lot of time putting your looks together. Team one, how was it doing it all in less than two hours? Well, on, to be honest, there, it wasn't a lot of pressure, um, but it, it was rather exciting. Rather exciting eh? yeah. So um, we were given a space to work with, so we tried our best to, to do what we do best, and that's design. Mm -hmm. So working with my coll a colleague of mine, it was, <laughs> it was quite fun. Okay, yeah. and team two, how did you find the time challenge? A lot of pressure? I think not so much, it was really exciting. I think our concept and the feeling and the mood that we wanted to bring about was really strong and I hope you can see that. So, <laughs> we yeah. can indeed, so it's up to you at home to go and vote. Head on over to our Facebook page, go choose either team one or team two. We'll tell you who wins and just, just before the end of the show, so don't go anywhere. But we still have a lot coming up for you. In fact, Ewan has those details.